Hey everyone, welcome back to On the Fence Movie Reviews. I am Adrian. And I'm Rob. So today we're going to be talking about Onward! So Onward is the latest Pixar film uh, associated with Disney and it stars uh, Chris Pratt, Tom Holland, uh, Julie... Julia Louis-Dreyfus, I have a hard time saying her name, uh, and Octavia Spencer. And um, it's a story about two young uh, boys who lose their dad at a very young age. And actually, the younger one, Tom Holland's character, um, actually never got to meet his dad. And so the dad found a special jewel and the staff and had a spell that could bring him back for 24 hours. But as they are trying to activate the spell, it gets interrupted and uh, they can only complete half of it, which leaves the lower half of their dad. So they have to go on this quest to find another jewel to bring back the rest of dad before the 24 hours is up. So Rob, let's jump right into it. What did you think about Onward? You know what, Adrian? Um, I thought it was like a, like a kind of, I guess, cute movie. Okay. I mean, it, it I, I, I liked it. It had, obviously it's a, uh, it's kind of fairy tale ish, and yes. and this the way the this world, you know, I really like the world that they put this story in. Yes, and because for me, growing up, even now, uh, I liked magical creatures. I like you know spells and wizards and 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 unicorns even, and this whole uh, adventure takes place in that type of fairy tale world, and I just really enjoyed everything about it. I mean, the story was good even even great i came out of this movie and I, I had the happies yeah and i was like i like this movie and pieces of it were very predictable for me okay especially kind of towards the end yeah i kind of saw what was coming but at the same time i was like you know what this story's good i enjoyed you were able to just I go mean, with it yeah i enjoyed the relationship between the two brothers and uh just how all almost opposite they were yeah and but at the same time being so opposite they kind of uh balanced each other out yes and i feel like everyone in this movie did a good, as far as the voice acting did a really good job <clears throat> the the storytelling this movie was really good um again you know little things as far as the uh the negatives of being a little predictable but other than that i really enjoyed this movie what yeah. uh, how did you feel about this movie i i, I really really enjoyed this film All a right. lot there's um, two reallys i i, I... <laughs> I, you know what? It's funny is because I, I was reading other reviews and some people were kind of talking about it because the thing about Pixar is is a lot of times their films are a bit high concept, right? You got okay. like like right. films like Wally, e Ratatouille, or Rat That Cooks. You know, like yeah. you got like these, um, and people were kind of like, oh, it's just an adventure story, and like you know, it's it's pretty straightforward. But to me, it was a little bit more. It was really the story about the, these two brothers and and the importance of family. Yeah. You know, in in the absence of a parent, you know, and how important that relationship of siblings can be right. when you have something like that going on. And then also too, like you said, I forgot to mention it that the the about the world. It's yeah. It's um, it's you know, it was a a, a fantasy world with like you know um. Uh, the Manticore, which is yeah. Octavia Spencer's character, <laughs> uh, unicorns, uh, elves, uh, wizards, and all that other stuff. And then over time, they get more accustomed to their technology right. and they forget about their past. And so it, it has something to say about that as well as like how we can be over reliant sometimes on, on, on technology, our technology and yeah. stuff like that. But but also, you know, just creating this adventure, you know, and I, I just loved it because it was, you know, it was an adventure. It was a, it was a fun adventure film. And, you know, I, I, I really loved it because it, it just it hit me right in the fills, you know, at the end there. Yeah, and you got the happies. And yeah, I got the happies, and and I didn't feel too distraught at the end and like emotional that yeah. like I couldn't recover at the end of the day. But you know what? I I think it's a home run for Pixar. I I really enjoyed the story. I really enjoyed the the concept. Um, and I think fans of of fantasy and like you know Dungeons and Dragons yeah, and like say, all D &D. the other stuff like. The games like that, I think, will will really enjoy this because I think this is a cool, like, kind of a Kickstarter, a Kickstarter for children, yeah, in a sense to kind of introduce them to the world of fantasy and and stuff like that. Um, but I really enjoyed it, and I, I can't say enough good things and positive things about it. You know, I mean, it's Pixar. I mean, they, yeah, they, really they never do anything really wrong. <laughs> yeah. So, uh, Rob, 
with all that being said, uh, are you going to get off the fence and uh, go watch this film, or are you going to? You know, Adrian, I would say definitely uh, get off this fe- get off the fence. Go check this movie out. This movie has heart. Uh, you know, family. Uh, just I, I again, I can't I can't uh, bring it up enough. It's just the relationship between the two brothers and and uh, you know how real it was. I don't have yeah. a brother, but I have a sister and. Uh, I kind of like I could see little you know you know oh yeah, yeah the sibling the, dynamic yeah the, si- yeah the sibling dynamic in there and it's just really enjoyable and again you know I left with the happies and it's just you know it, at the end I was smiling so I would have to say you know get off the fence go check this movie out I'd say definitely in the theater because of the like how much it just pops on screen with all the yeah. colors and everything that they use in this movie and what about you Adrian. I'm going to say, if you're on the fence, get off the fence, go to your local theater, go watch this film, and you're going to have a good time, you know, with your family or even just by yourself, go watch it. And, um, yeah, I mean, it's another Pixar home run. For me, it's a home run. I mean, some people might not feel that way, but I felt that way, and I thought that it was great. So why don't you go check it out? So, guys, thanks for watching our review of Onward. If you guys agree with our review, why don't you comment down below and let us know. Or if you disagree, let us know that, too. Um, if, don't forget to click like, subscribe, share, and uh, also follow us on Instagram at On the Fence Movie Reviews. And remember, we'll catch you on the fence. <laughs>